thought today I would do a haul vlog. I haven't done a haul vlog in, it feels like, ages. And that's mainly because I haven't really been out shopping. We've been trying to be good lately and save money as we are saving up for our holidays and our America holiday in Disneyland Paris in December. So not really been out shopping and trying to be good. However, the shops at the minute are absolutely full of sales and I literally cannot resist a good sale and bargain. And I'm sorry, but if something is in the shop and it's half price or less, and it's in my size, or Chris's size, or the girl's size, it's coming home. I'm sorry, but it's coming home. <laughs> Whether they need it or not, if it's half price, they need it. So I've picked up some real bargains over the last probably week or two, um, so I thought I'd do a quick vlog and show you what I've got. Yesterday I had my little nephew Harrison for the day as my sister took her older children to Flamingoland which is a theme park here in the UK and she didn't want to be, um, she wanted to have fun with the three older children and be able to go on rides and things. So I had Harrison with Chris, we had such a lovely day with him and it would have been rude not to visit a shop, right? I don't have any boys, I have three girls so was quite excited to go and look at some boys clothes and picked him up a few things. I did send them home with him yesterday obviously when I dropped him off home but I took a quick vlog in the car so that I could show you what I bought for him so I'll insert that now. So I just realised we're about to take Harrison home after picking Isla up from dancing and with him I will be sending home the clothes I got him today in Asda. So just wanted to really quickly show you them because they are so adorable and if I don't show you them now, I won't be able to. So the first thing I got him was this super duper cute cardigan. It was actually in the sale for four pounds and I just thought that was so, so adorable. The next thing was this cute little shirt style romper. It's got trousers and it's just like a real granddad shirt, which I just think are so sweet on boys. And this was also four pounds, reduced from seven, so. Can't wait to see him in this. And then I also picked him up this really sweet short set, which will be great for summer. And just thought it was really sweet. This was also in the sale. And it was six pounds. Then the final thing I bought him, which I just so miss shopping for, baby toys. I thought this was so, so cute. It can be hung on his pram or his car seat and it's got all sensory things on it, kind of tags and squishy, squishy things. So yeah, picked him that up too. And I hope Katrina, my sister, likes them all. So they're the things I got for Harrison, super duper cute. I love shopping for babies. Like even now, I don't have a baby, I was four, I'm not pregnant and I still can't help looking at baby clothes when I go into shops. But anyway, moving on. Here are some things that I've bought the girls um, over the last week or two, and yeah, they'll be really good for the holidays. The six week, they break up next Friday, so summer holidays are around the corner, and we just go through so many clothes. We do loads of things in the holidays, and usually it's very messy, ice creams, sand, things like that. So they go through loads of, not dressy up clothes but kind of just comfy clothes like leggings and things like that. Rather than doing each girl I thought I would just show you what I bought from each shop. So the first shop I'm going to start off with as I just showed you Harrison's which were from Asda I'm going to carry on with Asda. So I picked up this really cute white kind of vest fl vest flo blue, blue. <laughs> white vest floaty top for Isabel. It's just a plain white top has some really nice detail on it on the back and as you can see there that was six pounds was six but actually it was seven anyway I got this for three pounds and just thought that'd be really nice for summer with a cardigan a jacket something like that to go with that I also got her these navy blue leggings they kind of remind me of like um horse riding leggings skinny at the bottom and then it's got some zips and as you can see these were £9 and they were reduced to £4. So literally a whole outfit for £7. That's definitely coming home with me. And then I also bought from Asda a whole load of things. Right, 
these skinny jean type trousy things for Isla. They're kind of like um, a mix between light pink and turquoise, not turquoise, light pink and lilac. These were £3. I don't know why they don't have a sticker on, but they were half price. They were £3. They have adjustable waist and yeah, just really nice colour for summer. And then I also got Isla these... I never buy these type of trousers for my girls, I don't know why, because they're super comfy and they do look cute on, but I don't know, I just tend to not buy these type of trousers, but I couldn't resist these. These were £3, reduced from 6 and they are, are they like combat trousers, is that what you call them? I don't know, thin material, stretchy waist, you can wear them 3 quarter or full length and I just thought they were really pretty. And to go with that, I got this sweet. I thought that was a pen mark. I thought that was a pen mark there. Anyway, I got this really sweet t-shirt, which was £2. So I thought they'd go really nice together. Then for Isla, I also got this, which is a two-piece set. It's kind of a really nice lilac um, dress top type thing with some leggings underneath. And this was £7, reduced to £3. I love lilac on girls. I think it's such a nice colour. It's not, it's not a colour that you see all the time. And it always suits my girls really well. So, happy with that. Then I also got Isla this cute little t-shirt which says, Sparkle is my favourite colour. I agree. Sparkle's my favourite colour too. Thought this would go with some skinny jeans or some leggings or anything like that. And for £1, it was not staying in Asda. That was coming home with me for a pound. The last thing for Isla was this sweet cardigan. I don't know if you'll be able to tell, but it has like... No, you really can't tell. It has like a pink copper type... What do you call it? Thread going through it? Is it like thread? Really nice anyway, and this was £4. Moving on to good old Primax, I got Isabel these really cute jeggings. Isabel's always saying she likes skinny jeans but she hates how they feel. So she says they're too tight and restrictive, so these are going to be perfect for her. They're like really nice soft material, but look like skinny jeans, but are actually comfy leggings. These were £4 from Primax, and yeah, they'll be great for her over summer. And then I thought this was a really nice top to match. It's just kind of a shirt, a bit more grown up. Isabel's kind of getting to the stage now where she wants to wear things that are not the same as... Isla and Esme, mainly because people at school say things to her about it. Um, so anyway, yep, we got her some nice, more grown-up clothes. This was £6, so £10 for both. I also got Isabel some skinny jeans because although I did just say she doesn't like how they feel, these are really nice soft material. They look really fluorescent in this light, but they're... Let's see if I can get a better... Yeah. That smaller colour, this colour here. So, yep, some skinnies, and they were £5.50. I also got her them in this colour. It's kind of a raspberry, a raspberry colour. Oh, spot on my face. Sorry, it's kind of a raspberry colour. Really, really cute, really nice. She actually wore these for her daddy's birthday on Wednesday. We went out for a meal with a hashtag selfie top. But she's taken that to wear for netball after school, so I can't show you that. But it's super, super cute and she loved it. She thought it was great. So to go with those two pair of skinny jeans, I bought her a few t-shirts. Oh, let me just say, these, guess how much? Go on, guess. Two pounds. Two pounds from Primark. <sighs> okay, so to go with those, I got this t-shirt. Two minutes, Isla. Really nice. This was £1.90. Then I also got her this one. And then it's kind of got glittery love hearts on it. So, really pretty. And then the other t-shirt was this one. 
These were all £1.90, so really, really good value. Doesn't matter if they get ruined or stained over the summer because they're so cheap. And yeah, really nice designs and kind of a little bit more grown up, so. Forgot to show you, I've just found it in the bottom of the bag, this one. I can't believe I forgot it, it's my favourite. This one says, I'm a unicorn, but it's actually magic. Watch this. I'm a unicorn. And it is a unicorn. How cool is that? Magic. I did also buy Isla and Esme the fluorescent pink skinny jeans. I bought them to that as well and a matching top that says beautiful. It's a white top and says beautiful in the fluorescent pink. However, they wore those for daddy's birthday meal, our night out, and they're in the washing machine. So can't show you those right now. So I got Esme these shoes. These were not sale items. These were just from Asda, but she doesn't have any comfy pretty sandaly type shoes so I went ahead and bought these I think they were about £10 they're just really really pretty and perfect for Esme she likes a bit of a heel and so these have got a bit of a heel but not too much because she's only seven and she loves these showed her them this morning and she put them straight on as soon as she got out of bed <laughs> I also did an online order at New Look as they have some amazing sale items for ladies. They do have children's as well but I won't bore you showing you the clothes that I got because hey women's clothes are not as exciting to look at as what children's are. I did get Isabel a beautiful lightweight jacket from New Look and she just loves it so much but I can't seem to find where she's put it right now so I will insert a picture of her or maybe a little video and I'll insert that here. <laughs> My mum got me this jacket from New Look and I really, really like it. I love all these swirly parts and it's really silky. So that's Isabel's beautiful new jacket. It's yeah. really grown up, isn't it? Yeah. I will show you the shoes I got in the sale though because they are beautiful. They're so, so nice. And I wouldn't usually pick these off the shelf because I'd think they were way too high, but I tried them on in the shop and just thought they were the nicest things ever. So that's these. They do look super high, but as they have the platform here, it's kind of really only that that's the heel. They just look so nice. And then online I bought these ones. Black, because black goes with everything. And these were in the sale. They should have been £20, which is actually a really good price, but I got them for 14 These were online, and these ones should have been £40, and I got them for £19.99. So, little Isla just joined me and asked if she could show you the final thing that she's got this week. But just before she does that, I just wanted to show you something that turned up today that I am so so excited about. I am on a Facebook page that is all about Disney, in fact I'm on about 15, but one of them includes people who work at Disney stores, um, anything to do with Disney, maybe cast members from parks and things like that, and someone posted a link to an animator's Disney princess animator suitcase cabin size that hasn't yet been released officially, however they'd managed to get the link and they posted it on the page and I was so excited it was literally the most beautiful case i've ever seen my girls love the animator dolls and they got i think they had pretty much all of them between all three of them so i was so so excited to see this suitcase it's gorgeous and i ordered two because we are, i actually only planned on getting one for isabel but i could not justify spending five pounds on postage cost five pounds on postage so I ordered two so that I didn't have to pay the postage. I spent an extra £30 so that I didn't have to pay postage cost. Please tell me I'm not the only lady who does that. It's like when I made my order on New Look. I bought the £14 pair of shoes so that I didn't have to pay £3.95 postage delivery charge. It's my turn. In a minute, sweetheart. Yeah, so I've ended up with two of these cases. I did cheeky. Mm -hmm. I did plan on selling one because 
I only needed one for Isabel. But after seeing them, I've decided that Esme will have one too, as I know she's going to love it. So, are you ready to see the cutest suitcase ever? Should we show them, Isla? Yeah. Ready, ready, ready! Yeah. How gorgeous is that? <coughs> it's so nice! It has the spinny wheels on all four, so if it's heavy, there's no turning it on its side and lugging it. You can literally just wheel it alongside you, which is great for um, children. It has the animator silver logo here, silver writing. And then all the princesses. Oh! <laughs> you okay? That was fun. And all over the back too, it has this beautiful contrast coral, kind of mix between coral and hot pink. Oh my gosh, I think it's gorgeous. I've, I have just noticed that it actually has a protective cover on it right now. <gasps> Oh, it's so shiny! I didn't even notice that! I thought it was like this dull colour, but it's not, it's so shiny! <gasps> Look how shiny that bit is! Where can I see? Oh my god, I'm in love. I think this is the nicest case I've ever, ever seen. I'll show you inside really quickly. Can I show them, show them the bits in the other side too? I will. So, this is cabin size. But as you can see, it's rather big. And looking there. Has a secret compartment. <laughs> this is great for things like toiletries and things like that. Obviously not if you're flying because you can't take toiletries in your hand luggage. But if you're going on a weekend away or anything like that, that's great. It keeps your toiletries um, separate from your clothes. And then clothes part. And these were really, really good value for money. These cases usually cost around £90 and this one from the Disney store was a bargain price of £29.99. So I am so, so happy with these and I'm so excited for the girls to get home from school so that I can show them. Come on, come and show them what you got. She got this t-shirt too yeah. actually, didn't you? This was £1 from Asda. Very pretty. Here. Can I show them what you've got? Go on. I'm going to show you my coat and it has lots of scrubs on it and it to have cool pockets. And it's really fluffy. It's beautiful. Let's put it the right way. Can I put it on Why me? don't you show them? Yeah, on me. Okay. Well, it's not going to go on me, is it? No. This is Isla's new raincoat and I read it today just in case it was going to rain and it did rain yep it did a little bit but not so much cute and look look at these cool pockets got little pockets hasn't it and the way it's cute and how much was your new coat in the Asda sale? Mm, don't know. Four pounds. Four pounds! Really, really cute coat. Waterproof and a really nice strawberry design, which is really pretty. And it also is fleece lined. I did the button, Mummy. Well done. And as you can see, it's got a really nice fleece lining, but not too. Fleece? Fleece? Fleece lining, but it's not too thick, obviously, because yeah, it's summer. and it's really fluffy. And it's really fluffy and comfy. Do you love it? Yeah. Yeah, it was Daddy's birthday on Wednesday, so we went to the River Island sale, and got him a few jumpers. And I was sick. Yeah, little Isla was sick on Wednesday, weren't you? Because <laughs> I might have a little bug, but... No, you got a bit travel sick. Yeah. We just turned up to the restaurant for Daddy's birthday and little Isla decided to vom everywhere. <laughs> but she was fine. As soon as she did that, she was absolutely fine. It wasn't yeah. a bug because she ate straight after. She ate a bread roll yeah. and some and dinner. And after all, the sick friends with your really friends was doing some stuff that's really funny. Were you? Yeah. Mm. Good. <laughs> <laughs> 
Did it turn you crazy? Yeah, yeah it turned me crazy. <laughs> right then, let's end this vlog because it's probably going to be dragging on for ages. What do we say to everyone? Bye! See you later, say thank you for watching!